So today we're going to be speedrunning through an interesting Spongebob game. This is Mr. Krabs overdoses on ketamine. So I think you can kind of get the gist of it um, just from the title. So let's just start the game. You'll see what it's like in just a second. Did I, did I not click play? Let me try that again, please. There we go. See, so we start out right away, and the first thing we want to do is get this ketamine that's just right there for us, and then we want to drive our boat. Now, the boat driving physics in this game leave a little bit to be desired. You kind of just slide all over the place, but Mr. Krabs never was a great driver in the first place. He's just like SpongeBob in those retrospects, so he can deal with it. We got a whole cast of beautiful people just walking through, but we don't really care about them. We have to go ahead and deliver all this ketamine to our friends. So right now what we're doing is we're getting five ketamine so we can give all of that to SpongeBob because you know, he's going through withdrawals and since he is our worker and he is our friend, we gotta give it to him. And this boat is not supposed to be moving yet, but it works out well for us because it's just in a better position. I don't really know what that was about. We're gonna go drive right over to SpongeBob. We're gonna try to stop our boat so we can use it Please, later. Mr. Krabs, I need you to get my catamade. It's in the town over there. Please, Mr. Krabs, I'm fiending. Yeah, SpongeBob has it really tough in this world, but we're gonna go ahead and give him his ketamine. Thank you so much, Mr. Krabs. Oh, you're a lifesaver. If you want to go get more good stuff, go see Patrick. He's on the other end of town. You know, every time I see Patrick, it's still the shock. The It doesn't wear out. So we're going to drive over to Patrick right now with these terrible driving physics. Hopefully, we'll be able to get there kind of soon. All right, come on, break. We got to keep our car here. Oh, Mr. Krabs, you are still doing ketamine. <laughs> Take a man's life. <laughs> so now we have to go and kill a man, or five men to be more exact. So we're just gonna go right ahead. We can see the nice little arrows that are pointing to the people that we're gonna be killing. You know, that's nice that it's giving that to us. And we just gotta go and like punch them. They don't even fight back. We just kinda take care of them, it's nice and easy. I don't know what these poor people did deserve this, but you know, they're smiling as they go out, so that's nice. It makes me feel a little less bad when I'm killing them. Oh, and those people are trying to deal with me, but I'm not gonna worry about them because I have my mission to do. All right, stop chasing after me, please. I'm just trying to go and get my ketamine. Please. Okay, did we take care of them? All right, we killed them, good. We got all of those people done. So now we're gonna go right back to Patrick. We'll take this boat. There are a lot of boats that we kind of just take. I don't think they're ours, but I mean, close enough, I guess. No, you're an epic gamer. Go suck off Squidward. And now it's time to go suck off Squidward. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, we don't actually do that. Or I guess fortunately, to be completely honest, we don't actually go ahead and do that. But instead, we got another mission we have to do for Squidward. Oh, okay, Mr. Krabs, calm down. It's okay. Everything is fine, Mr. Krabs, I promise. Just gonna leave this boat. Hopefully those two boats can do whatever they're trying to do and we're gonna move on with our life. What, what? Hey, Mr. Krabs, I need you to sell these drugs to Sandy. She's in town. Make sure you get my money. The people of this place have a lot of problems they have to deal with, and now we can actually go ahead and use our ketamine, which basically gives us super speed and also heals us. And Sandy just babbles on. Um, we don't really know what she does. I, did you just see those people come? They're attacking me. Stop it. Oh my god. I'm just trying to go and get to the chump bucket, please. So Sandy basically wants us to go deal with Plankton, so we're gonna ketamine run all the way over there, and we're gonna continue on, take out the boss, hopefully. So we can go right here. Okay, that person just tried to murder me. I have glitched randomly out of this area, which kind of sucks. And I don't know what causes that, but we basically have to get that key. Oh, we didn't get that ketamine. That's it. Please, excuse me. I'm trying to run through. Oh God, this is the hardest platforming of the entire game because you don't know what all these objects are that are on the ground. <laughs> but we can get right through here. And this is a coin toss. Yeah, we, we lost it. I don't really care, I'm gonna call that time. So right at the end of the game, there's a 50-50 chance that you kill Plankton or you just lose the game. And there we lost the game, but either way, that is the end of the run. Oh, I'm gonna have to do this again, aren't I? Whoa! 
Oh my god, it just killed me. I was just trying to do the speed run again and my car just killed him. Oh, come on. You know what? You guys got your speed run. That's all I'm going to do. Don't you drugs, kids.